everybody welcome back once more to um, to my channel life on the street with Abdurafiu Ayuba and I'm Bob L happy new year to all of you okay we're going back to the saga of um, portable and um, Poco Lee how he started with his um, Zazu song how the song went up how the song went viral and then Pokoli, according to Potibu, wanted to take ownership of the song. But we all thank God, though. Potibu got his song back and then he got his reward and he's still getting more reward. Okay, now let's um, say. Now, does this, um, this lady from the music industry came out to advise, um, Pot, uh, to advise uh, um, Olamide and Pokoli, telling them that they should not just push portable into music. They should actually take him to school so he can learn the basics of music so his, his um, fashion will not run out. Because right now he's moving into the, into the, um, what, what should I call it, into the, the big, the big, the big, the big, big box office of music. So he should know the basics and everything. And then teach him how to make revenue from his music from his streams and then his every platform he has how to make revenue from them because obviously portable do not know these things for now and now that he's getting so much money they want him to go to school you know the Eurobars they are so down with school even the broke the most broke of them wants his child to go to school and that's why I'm proud of them so you see they want now they're coming out to say portable to go to school of music so he can actually learn the basics of music not just music alone as a business and i think it's a very good idea and it's a very good advice coming from the music industry to portable because if, if you look at it right now he doesn't have anything to cry about anymore he has money back then he didn't have anything but now he's a star so um, what she's expecting from him is to go to school of music, learn how to produce music, get more instruments for himself, for himself, and then save his own music, have his own record, have his own record with him, his own, his personal records, because these are the things they use against him, or should I say, these are the things they take advantage of from him. Because he has good music, he has good voice, he has good um, delivery to the extent that if he wants to take water from you, he does that with music, asking you for water. You can imagine how blessed he is. So what we're saying, what she said was, they should buy him music equipment that will actually make him learn how to produce his own beats. And I think this is really wise, if you think about it. Uh, here and there, last year, people are coming out with this story, uh, portable this, portable that, portable this, portable that. We were all, he was once broke like me and you. What do you expect him to do? What do you expect him to do? If somebody came out, somebody, someone came out for music, and then he got blessed, he met Olamide, that just took one line of the music that made the music go viral. So you see, he's hungry. I'm hungry, he's hungry. So if I go to stage and dance, and then people spray me money, trust me, oh my guy, no vex. I go go for my money, who carry the money? <laughs> but anyhow, Sha, Pokoli should have called him and told him how much he made from his dance before giving him that money. And you know, Portable is a child growing up to understand how to, to understand the, um, the, the, the mastering of how to, um, how to control yourself for money right now. So this is what I think that woman is trying to say to Olamide and Pokoli. They should teach, for me, and they should teach um, Portable how, 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 to, how to control money and not let money control him. They should teach him the basics of music. He should have his own platform. He should have his own. He should have his own studio in his bedroom, in his bedroom where he sleeps. Because I believe music comes from your dream, comes from your inspiration, comes when you're alone. Most people get their own when they're in the toilet, so they get their own inspiration. 
So you see, we, he, he should, they should get him instruments in his room and then teach him, take him to that school, teach him how to, how to make good music, not just music. Good music was what she said, and I truly respect that fact that she came out to say it. So you see, what she said was, she's not um, in any corner of anywhere, but you know, Afro will always be Afro. Like you see the days of um, them, Fela, Femikoti, and the rest of them, and this is what Portable is coming out with. But also, if he should go into it, he should understand the mastering, the spirit between, be, behind this Afro beat, Afro music. And then he should learn how to twist his music down to the layman's understanding too. So this is what I think she's trying to tell him. But anyway, let's all pray for him and then wish him well. So Happy New Year once more from me. Um, I'm Bob L. I rap live on the street with Abdurafiu Ayuba. If you're new to my channel, please click on the subscribe button and then the notification bell so you get every...